My reflection of our Catholic Church, our Church is first and foremost made up of people from all walks of life, and many are on their way to holiness. We are all sinners, but we try to be a good a worker of God, as God wants us to be, a loving and a forgiving person. The Church is created by our Almighty and loving Father, so all of us sinners have a place to offer our thanksgiving, to offer our sacrifices, and a place to receive His uh, overflowing love and grace. You know, the Church always embraces uh, sinners, and those who humble themselves before God, those who ask for forgiveness, those who always go to the sacrament of confession. And our Almighty Father has given the Church the heavenly treasures, His words and works, His life, and uh, His salvation through Jesus Christ. And the Catholic Church is entrusted with the divine treasure for all generations to come. Sinners belong to the church despite of their sins. It belongs to us all sinners. Now we sinners can even return to the church even in our last moment of life. Having received our Catholic baptism, we will always carry in ourselves the hope of reconciliation and forgiveness from our Heavenly Father. You know, we don't judge the church for the sins of the church's uh, children. The sins of the members does not belong to, to the church. It belongs to our enemy. Therefore, it would be a shame if we judge the church on the basis of what he is not. The Holy Spirit has watched over the church from its uh, foundation. And uh, the church is the source of sanctity of our community. The church is the fountain of holiness. The church has uh, produced many saints down through the centuries, all through these years. There were who died giving up their lives for the faith that they uh, profess. But there are also countless parents who have lived faithfully and did sacrifices as parents trying to be example for their uh, children. Similarly, there are also those uh, single men and women who strive holiness in the world where commercialism is uh, prevalent. And the church is uh, holy because of the action of the Holy Spirit and not because of the behavior of the human members who are uh, sinners. And as uh, followers of Christ, as a good Catholic, we uh, ask the Lord to help us increase our desire for personal sanctity so that we might be worthy as His sons and daughters, and that whatever we do in this life is according to His will.